Carbeth Plants is a company that specializes in clean air indoor plants. These plants are known to improve the air quality in a room by removing pollutants and toxins. Some common clean air indoor plants include English ivy, spider plant, snake plant, and Boston fern. These plants can be used in homes, offices and other indoor spaces to help improve the air quality and create a healthier environment. Indoor plants are able to clean the air by absorbing pollutants and toxins through small openings on their leaves called stomata. They also release oxygen and moisture into the air, which can help to improve air quality. One way plants clean air is through a process called phytoremediation, which is the use of plants to remove pollutants from soil or air. They do this by absorbing pollutants through their roots or leaves and breaking them down in their cells or storing them in their tissues. Another way is through the process of photosynthesis, which is how plants convert light energy into chemical energy. During photosynthesis, plants take in carbon dioxide from the air and release oxygen as a byproduct. This process can help to reduce the levels of carbon dioxide in a room and increase the levels of oxygen. The peace lily, Spathophyllum, is a popular indoor plant that is known for its ability to purify the air. It is a tropical plant that prefers low light conditions and high humidity. It has dark green leaves and produces white, spathe-shaped flowers that resemble lilies. They are easy to care for and known for removing pollutants like formaldehyde, benzene, and trichloroethyl. The spider plant, also known as chlorophytum camosum, is a popular houseplant known for its easy care and ability to purify the air. The plant has long, narrow leaves that arch out from the center and produce small white flowers. Spider plants are known to be effective at removing pollutants such as formaldehyde and xylene from the air, making them a good choice for use in homes or offices. Spider plants are easy to care for, they prefer bright, indirect light and well-draining soil. They are also tolerant of a wide range of temperatures and humidity levels. They can be propagated easily by dividing the offsets that grow from the mother plant. They are also known to be non-toxic to pets and humans.